I'm Jenny Lu. We're learning Yang style Tai Chi 24 short form step by step. In this video, we're going over sequences number three and four. If you missed the first two moves, make sure to check on this channel under the playlist Yang style Tai Chi 24 form to catch up. And if you want to learn with us like this step by step, please subscribe to the channel, click the bell next to it so you get notified next week when I come out with new videos. Let's get started. We are going over sequences three and four in back view in this video, as if you're following me in class. In the next video, I'm going to record a mirror image for the first four sequences so you can catch what you might have missed from the front view. Okay, all right, so let's get started. So um, if we started it facing this way, we would have ended up right here with the second move, the last move, which was parting wild horses mate. So you can take your bow stance and then um, how wide you take your bow stance is really up to you, depending on your flexibility, how stable you feel. So make sure you're adjusting, okay, for your body's condition. So next move is called wide crane spreads wings, bai he liang chi. So taking your time, you're going to slowly shift the weight to the front leg so we can take a half step with the back foot and start to spin your hands. We're gonna hold the ball and turn the pelvis a little bit to the right and then we are sitting on the back leg now because we're preparing for that empty foot stance and then as you turn your torso slightly from the pelvis right from your qua right hand raises up to about the two uh, two o'clock position to on the right side so raise your hand up and then the left hand is going to do a sweep so eventually you're going to end up right here torso facing forward right hand, palm facing in, left hand, uh, after you swept off your knee, and then your left foot is about 5% on the toes, okay? So we're gonna do it again, smoother. Both stands in your parting wild horse's mane, the third move, shift the weight, half step with the back foot, hold the ball, turn the torso slightly, right hand raises up, left hand swipe the knee and then you're sitting on your back leg torso straight Y crane spreads wings very good and you can close right here okay so now sequence number four fresh knee and twist step so we ended up here in back view Y crane spreads wings you're sitting on the back leg so this is three moves that we're gonna take. So taking your time, start to slowly turn your torso to your left side. Right hand is gonna come down, draw a circle, half circle. And then when this hand comes to about the elbow area, your left hand is gonna come up and then draw a circle in. As this hand comes in, your left foot is gonna come back closer to your right foot. And then your right hand is going out to the side. So once you're here, we're gonna slowly take that step now. Left heel down, so box stepping to the left diagonal corner. And then as we come down here, right hand is gonna kinda come closer to your ear. And then we're going to brush that left knee. So you're gonna brush that knee as you go into both stands. So you know when you turn your pelvis, your back foot is gonna pivot on the ball of the foot. And then so left knee, you're brushing the left knee, right hand is a palm strike, okay? And then slowly we're gonna take two more steps, so like this, you shift your way back, now we're using Tai Chi slow walking. So pivot the front foot, open your front foot, and then start to slowly, as you shift your weight forward, left hand is gonna come up, right hand circled in, and then we're going to slowly take that right foot, heel down, and this left hand now is gonna come in closer to your ear. So the turn, the power comes from your lower body. So as we turn the pelvis, are you going to brush that right knee and then the back foot, make sure you pivot. So protect that knee. Palm strike on the left side. We're gonna do one more. Right hand goes out, left hand comes in, the left foot comes in, and then we're gonna slowly step and press okay 
great and then we're gonna finish right here inhale and exhale yeah so make sure to catch the next video where we're gonna review so it'll be a smoother sequence in mirror image okay and then leave in the comment section below and tell me if you prefer to learn in mirror image or back view and I will um, record my videos in those views that's better for you to learn okay all right so i look forward to seeing you in the next video again subscribe and share comment and practice all right see you